today we're going to give you guys a couple of quick tips on producing good mental strength. And Ryan is a tournament player, I have a tournament background, and I think throughout you know, our drills and practice sessions and things like that, we've kind of come up with a number of different things that really help golfers. And one of the things that I really like uh, is writing down your practice sessions. So literally keeping a log, I have one on my phone. Uh, if you have a little notebook that you keep in your golf bag, it works really well. And just after you're done with your practice session, whatever you're working on, write down the things that you want to remember. So I might write down, you know, putting, keeping my head down until the ball goes into the hole, uh, full swing. If I'm working on a cut shot or something along those lines, it really helps to kind of jot those down. And then lastly, before I kind of finish up uh, with my notebook, I like to write down really good shots that I hit. Whether it's during a tournament round, for you beginner golfers, your first time on the driving range can be really intimidating. So I think writing down the good shots that you do hit will help you forget about the bad ones because you know humans are wired to remember the negatives over the positives. It's a survival instinct. Yeah, I, I totally agree with having a little notebook and writing all that down. And for me, it's something that's always really, really helped me that I think would help a lot of you as well is writing down little little tips that help you. You know, if you're if you're chipping or if you're putting and you know keeping your your lower body still, if that's something that just really helps you, whatever it may be, write it down. And before you before you go and hit that shot, just take a look. Have it in your pocket. Oh, keep my lower body still. Okay. Great reminder and a powerful just just powerful reminder to help you make a good shot and then remember that. Go back and like, okay, that really helped me. And then there, there might be things that pop up over time, you know, a month later, there might be something else that helps you write that down. And, you know, you can even take a Sharpie and just write, you know, the two letters, you know, uh, still lower body, you know, like SL, whatever it is, you can write on your glove and it's just a reminder when you look down at your hand, okay, let me do that. So that, that's really good, writing things down is, is awesome. Yeah, it's amazing how many different variables there are in golf and I can't tell you, I mean, we practice almost every day now, and there's so many times where I come to the range and I'm like, okay, what was I working on yesterday? Yeah. <laughs> you know, what was, my putting was great the other day, all of a sudden, oh, I forgot about my setup, you know. Uh, it's always little things that I think make big difference. And even today we're working on my driver, and I was hitting all my shots really well, gets a driver, and it was kind of like, you know, what's going on here? And I just would, a couple of swings in between, I was hitting three with perfectly. So um, having those reminders, I think is super crucial. And then also having a partner, you know, having a partner, you know, Ryan looks at my swing a lot. I look at his game as well and helping each other out, you know, not only to film your golf swing, uh, but just in general, you know, hey, uh, so-and-so you're lined up a little bit more left than you want to be. Um, and those helpful reminders will kind of help you along in this game and and i think that that notebook and, and really writing things down is is crucial you know absolutely yeah so go ahead and just try to remember the positives write down the positives and most importantly just have fun you're new to the game enjoy it you're going to get better enjoy that process absolutely